rollout was being completed. They were met by hundreds, if not thousands, of cheering ethnic Albanians who have spent the last three months shuttered in their homes, afraid to come out for fear of arrest, beatings, or being forced to leave Kosovo. But the British peacekeepers found some Yugoslav troops still in the border town, including this armored vehicle with a pair of mounted machine guns. The Yugoslav vehicle tried to force its way down the street to push back cheering crowds, but was met head-on by K-4 armor. After a five-minute standoff and the exchange of words, the Yugoslavs retreated amidst jeers from the crowd and shouts of UCK, UCK, and NATO, NATO. It wasn't the last confrontation. Armed Yugoslav soldiers also tried to push back the cheering Albanians on the streets, and British peacekeepers countermanded their orders. Under terms of the agreement, the area is to be completely clear of Yugoslav police and soldiers by 6 in the evening. The British forces said stragglers would be pushed along to force them to either lay down their arms or leave. Jim Clancy, CNN, Prestige.